Greetings. Welcome back to my channel, Ham Radio Test and Review. Today, I'm going to be testing the weather band uh, capabilities of the iRadio UV98, which is the same as the Rantel RT880. Uh, to, what I've also brought to the uh, video here is the Baofeng BFF8 HP Pro on the left and the TID Radio TDH3 Plus in the center. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go through each radio separately and we're going to see what capabilities each one of these radios brings to the table. I'm going to connect my external antenna and we'll get right back to you. Here in Arizona, NOAA only has seven actual stations that transmit out here. They go from 400, 425, 450, 475, 500, 525, and 550. Now, they are numbered 1 through 7 in that order. The Baofeng, as you will see when I turn it on, uh, has all seven stations. Actually, it's, I think, got 9 or 10. Um, and they are numbered 1 through 7 correctly per the NOAA website uh, for Arizona. So, Let's listen and see what the Balfang brings to the table. Skies ranged from mostly sunny to partly sunny. It was 89 at Phoenix, 86 at Las Vegas, and 79 at Kingman. So, frequency 400, northern Arizona nice strong signal. Number two, nothing. Number three, nothing. Number four, nothing. Number five, nothing. Number six, which is five and a quarter, temperature was 70 degrees. A nice strong signal. Now those are the two stations that I always get out here. They're, they're both very, very strong signals, and they're both. One is for Flagstaff. The one on uh, 525 is for Flagstaff, and the one on 400 is uh, more local for me, which is Prescott and uh, Cottonwood and uh, those areas. So let's take a listen a little bit. The skies were partly sunny. Temperature was 76 degrees and the relative humidity was 19%. Pressure was 29.91 inches and falling. So let's go to channel 7, which is 550. And we got nothing. All right, so that's what the Baofeng brings to the table. Nice sound. The two channels that uh, work out here. And really, that's all I need. However, let's hear what the... TDH3 brings to the table. The TDH3 has the weather channels misnumbered according to NOAA. Uh, NOAA starts their number one channel at 400 and goes up to 7, which is 550. This is 550, but it starts at channel 1. So uh, we know that we heard our two strong signals at 400 and 525. Let's hear what right, I've get. connected the external antenna. And let's hear what we might be able to hear. If you recall, we got uh, channels 400 and 525 on the Baofeng, which are the two close channels to here. So this is channel 550. And it's actually coming in and it says it's for conditions in Los Angeles which is really good, but we don't need it here in Arizona. But let's see what else we got. 20. Lows around 34. Windy. Here are the 2 p.m. regional observations. It's Flagstaff Airport skies were cloudy. So the 400 channel is one of our local channels. 475 is not one of our local channels, or it, it is an Arizona channel, but not around here. And we're getting some thing, but I can't understand what they're saying. Sorry. These buttons sometimes don't do so hard. There we go. So on 425 now, we are receiving something, but again, it's staticky. 20. On 450, we're receiving nothing. 20. 500, nothing. 
525 is our strongest Round channel, and of course we receive something. Here are the two PM observations. So it's interesting that the TID radio receives more and, and farther away channels than the Baofeng does. However, the sound quality is a little bit better on the Baofeng. So something you might want to take into consideration. So let's hear the iRadio now. Channel 1, now remember 400 and 525 are the two channels local to here. Once again, we're receiving the 550 channel, which is, of course, the LA channel, so that doesn't do us much good. Chances for showers and thunderstorms return for Thursday and continue through the beginning of next week. The stronger and colder storm system over the... Of course, 400 is our strong channel, and it sounds terrific. It's got good modulation, good clarity, good sound to it. 475. Barely hear something. Not sure if I can make it out. 425. Same thing. 450. Picking up a lot of stuff. 500. Snap. Here are other. Observations. 500, 525, of course, is our strongest channel. Sunny to partly sunny. So, what can I conclude from this? Well, turns out that the I radio picks up uh, almost every, picks up something from almost every channel. Uh, the TIT radio actually did a little bit better because there was one or two channels where you could just barely make out what they were saying, uh, including the Los Angeles channel. Uh, but the iRadio also picked up the Los Angeles channel. So um, I think the iRadio is a good radio for weather. Um, I would also consider the TID Radio TDH3 Plus as well. Uh, however, we're not testing that today. So uh, what can we tell you? One test is worth a 1,000 expert opinions. This is Dave, Prescott, Arizona. My call sign is N8DAV. My name is in my call sign, and I'm here to tell you, 73s and so long.